DJI Flight Hub 2, the Dock 3, and the Matrice 4D series, a powerful combination. We're gonna talk about how they work together. Don't go anywhere. Hey everybody, David here from Aerial Influence. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. Today, we are talking about the DJI Flight Hub 2. Now, what is DJI Flight Hub 2? It is a cloud-based flight management system, and it is specifically powerful when you use it with the DJI Matrice 4D series and the Dock 3. Now, of course, the DJI Dock 3 is DJI's latest drone in a box. So it uses the Matrice 4D series drones. Essentially, the drone lives in a box, whether that is at a fixed location, like on top of a building, or it can even be mobile, but the drone fits in that box, it charges in that box, it is deployed from that box. It's a really impressive system. And the way to operate that system is with DJI Flight Hub 2. Now we should start out by saying that DJI says that this system is completely secure. They use ASW servers in the United States, so your information is not being stored in another country where you don't want it to be. The idea behind Flight Hub 2 is essentially you've got a virtual cockpit. You've got a heads up display. You can open the box and launch the drone using Flight Hub 2. And of course the drone is IP55 rated and the box is IP56 rated. So these can sit outside and just live there. Or like I said, they are actually mobile. The Dock 3 is mobile. So you can put it on the back of a truck or something else and you can move it. Now the virtual cockpit is exactly kind of what it sounds like. You're gonna be able to see all the drone information you'll be able to see the same information that you would be able to see on a regular remote. You can launch the drone, you can land the drone, you can do precision flight planning, you can live stream and send that stream to all sorts of different people. They can watch it on their phone or their iPad or their computer. And you can hook up multiple drones. You could have four drones up in the air and you could be monitoring all four of those drones. Now, obviously, if you're a part 107 pilot, you have to keep the drone within your visual line of sight. So you have to be there when the drone launches, you have to be there when it's flying, and you have to keep it within your visual line of sight. But if you jump through the FAA hoops that you have to jump through, you can actually fly beyond visual line of sight. So that's what makes Flight Hub 2, the Dock 3, and the Matrice 4D series so powerful because somebody can be at a remote location, and as long as the Dock 3 has an internet connection, you'll be able to monitor that drone, you'll be able to launch it, everything from wherever you are. And of course, with the Matrice 4D series, you've got all of these features that go into it. So you've got like a fly to mode where you can point and the drone will go right to that location. You can do point of interest where you circle a pin. It does smart tracking where you can click on a car or a person or another moving object and it will follow that object using its zoom ring. And it's got a laser range finder and it's got RTK built in and it has attachments and the Matrice 4D is gonna be great for mapping because it has a big sensor with a mechanical shutter. Whereas with the Matrice 4TD, you've actually got a high resolution thermal camera on that one. So there are a ton of features with these drones themselves that you can control from Flight Hub 2. Now this whole system would be great for public safety. It would be great for security details. So say you're doing personal security for somebody, you could use Flight Hub 2 to set up routine routes where the drone every night at a certain time goes up and does its route and can alert you when it sees a person or something else out of the ordinary. This is literally the next step in the drone industry, the drone in the box, everybody's looking for it. You need something like Flight Hub 2, which is a great program, but you need it to be able to operate the dock system. Now, if you want more information on the Matrice 4D series, the Dock 3, or Flight Hub 2, go check out some of our other videos. We're making a whole bunch of them, and hopefully we answer your questions there. But if we didn't, make sure you reach out to us. You see the phone number, you see the email address on the screen, and it is in the description below. We appreciate you stopping by, and we'll see you next time.